In this video, I'm going to show you how you find your purchase history report on the site. In some cases, you're going to want to see what purchases you've made, and we made that very easy for you to find. So, when you are logged into the site, you see your name up here, and if you click on your name, uh, this menu uh, pops down, and you can see a whole bunch of reporting. You can uh, make adjustments to your account. Uh, you can see all the lectures that you've purchased. You can see all the completed certificates that you've earned. Uh, you can get a full transcript, uh, a lecture completion report, uh, that's very useful when you submit your CME to your hospital or your specialty board. You can see how many site credits um, you have. Uh, these are the credits that you buy and use to purchase individual lectures on the site. And finally, here's the purchase history report. So let's click on that. And uh, this shows you in reverse date order, the most recent at the top. Um, uh, all the purchases you've made. If there's a particular purchase you want to find and it's a long list, you can search for it. You can also print your um, history here. And I'd like to point out that you'll see both dollar purchases, uh, for example, this purchase of site credits, um, and also zero purchases, zero dollar purchases, which in most cases are spending your site credit uh, to uh, purchase access to individual lectures. So let's look at this particular purchase of site credit because it's a good example of uh, where I um, purchased site credit. I bought the smallest site credit package for $99, which got me 110 site credits. And then uh, in the same purchase, uh, I also spent some of that site credit on the purchase of individual lectures. So uh, this lecture, I pur uh, purchased for 15 site credits, I spent another 10 here, 10 and 10. Then it adds it up. So uh, I bought the 110 site credits for the $99. I spent 45 of them, leaving me with a site credit balance of 65 credits. So that um, is how you uh, look at your uh, purchase history on the site and how you get all that information.